Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Vanessa's Van Life Journey. How are you guys doing today? Today, I'm taking you guys on a field trip and I'm showing you guys some box trucks at this place in Houston, Texas, off the freeway uh, of 59 by Little York. And this is the name of, let me show y'all the name of the place. Y'all wanna drive down to Houston and find y'all some nice box trucks. This is the name of the place right here. And they have a lot, lot, lot of box trucks right now. So I'm going to walk you guys around and show you the different box trucks. I don't know what the lint would be on this one. Uh, but let's take a look in the inside. That is spacious, and that would make a spacious van life home. Oh my goodness. Look how spacious that is. Let's see what the price is on the front of this one. I think I want one a little shorter than this one. Let me see. That's a GMC. I don't, I don't see a price on it. Do they show how many miles? This is 123,000 miles on it. Looks good and clean on it. Uh, wow, very, very, very spacious inside. It's very, very, very spacious inside. The cab is very clean. There's no entryway to the back, so you'd have to make you a cutout if you wanted a cutout. And I got a salesman right here in my face. Uh, but yeah, it's very clean inside. I don't know what the price is on this one, so let me figure it out. Good morning. How you doing? I'm just looking. Uh, this one, how many feet is this one? 16. 16 feet? You have any shorter ones than this one? All of them are 16? And all of them are GMC? All of these are GMC. Okay, oh, the green ones are four, and all of them are 16 feet. And what's the average price running on them? 36,000. 36? They went up a little bit? They went up a lot. Yeah, because the last time I came here, I think they was like 23. Yeah, that was what, pre, way before COVID. Yeah. When it go up, they went up. Oh, the price of you getting them? Let me finish looking around. So he's saying that they're 30 something thousand and they have low miles, one owner and these are gmc thirty-seven thousand dollars, but thirty-seven thousand dollars, y'all for a big home like this and these are 16 feet these are 16 feet a hundred and forty one thousand miles on it and that's not that bad like i say they really 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 clean in the inside and I really like these. 16 feet, okay. That's the, is that the 10 feet and six feet? 10 feet and six inches high is how wide that is. We finance. And so I need to ask him like, how much is the average car note running? So these are GMC and these are Ford right here. Let me know in the comments bar below which one would you prefer. Y'all, I'm sorry I don't have my, uh, my mic on today to cut the wind down. I should have really put that on. So let's see how many miles the Ford has on it. A 
114,000 miles. I would want the Ford. Still same clean interior. I would want the Ford. So they have two Fords. So the Fords obviously are not that popular. And I guess that's where you would make the pass through it. And you kind of got a little sun roof because you got some sun in there, but I don't know how easy that is to cover with the solar panels. Y'all let me know in the description box below if y'all have a box truck, how easy it is to put solar panels up there and not to have any leaks. I really like this. It is very, very, very spacious and roomy. Y'all, let me get up in here. I will be able to stand up. I will be able to stand up. Y'all, they got some. It looks like they got some. They feel some cold stuff. It looks like they have a leak. Up in here. I would probably could change this to something else on your ceiling if you want to change your ceiling to something else. Uh, I'm going to go about this right here. I would want to change this to something else. And probably you want to stir your ceiling though. I'm going to check out the other ceiling and see if they're the same. But I don't know if I would need this like this to have a, a nice skylight or if I would want to um, take that off. But now this is so much room. Girl, I would know how to act. four people and then you have your tow thing on the back already to tow a trailer then you got your little thing right here for uh, a ladder or whatever this is nice y'all I really like this let me see is this one the same thing the same kind of ceiling so yeah I got the same kind of ceiling so let's take a look at the GMC's I think they gonna have the same kind of ceiling so like what are the car the notes running uh, like a month like what are they it averaging the down payment that you could what are y'all requiring uh, last time I, I came it was three thousand yeah, down no, we we, you can forget about all that. Yeah. Times change. Uh, you know, right now, probably six to eight thousand. Yeah. You know, just like everything, and the interest went up in the banks and all that. It should, everything just went up. So uh, it's a different monster right now. So, so the, the, the yeah, the car notes are averaging about how much? With, probably about nine hundred dollars a month. So nine like a month. Okay, and like how much? How many months are they financing for? The most they go is four years. Okay 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 that's very good information to know so he's saying about six to eight thousand dollars down last time i came here 
it was two to three thousand dollars down four thousand pound capacity maximum payload four thousand pounds it seems like that's kind of low four thousand pounds this big truck can't take no more than four thousand pounds y'all wow this is amazing this would make an amazing van life home and it could be very stealth because you don't have to have anything on the outside so y'all let me know in the comments bar below what y'all think this is 16 feet long i wouldn't want a 16 foot long one i would say 10 to 12 15 feet is long enough for me but i mean 16 i could do 16 but i don't know i think 16 makes it a little more commercial but y'all this is so much room and i can't even imagine how much the insurance would be on this a month uh this vehicle is not for sale these are not for sale not by nine hundred dollars a month can y'all afford one of these nine hundred dollars a month so that's a 2018 so all of these are 2018s and with a hundred and seven thousand miles on them that's actually not that bad that's not really bad at all so anyway you guys if you guys are interested in a box truck as a van home and you like my color yellow come check this place out in houston off of 59 and let them know vanessa's van life journey sent you and i will talk to you guys later i appreciate you watching and tuning in i'll actually talk to you guys some more once i get in the van and i know one thing i forgot to look at i forgot to look underneath i could look underneath anyone because the cab is the same i forgot to look underneath and see like the storage capabilities for underneath like for your water and stuff like that so let's get under here and have a look show you guys that so look you guys they have a lot of room that's about two to three feet across and all the way down there and all the way up here so you have plenty of room and I'm assuming that's gonna be on both sides you have plenty of room for storage if you want to have some storage containers built up under here just to show you both angles that is amazing so you wouldn't actually have to have no water in the inside of your vehicle uh, like this is nice y'all these would make some very nice homes but uh, I think that one is a shorter one right there, but it's not for sale. These are shorter. It, they look shorter. I don't know if they are or not. But anyway, you guys, that's going to be it. Let me know what you think. What you 
get one of these and turn it into a van home. Let me get me a picture in front of these trucks for my thumbnail. Okay, you guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this tour of these box trucks. Uh, if you're interested in getting you a box truck, let me know in a description box below. If you know of somewhere else to get the box trucks cheaper uh, and what would be the advantages to the box truck. Uh, if you have any insight on an easy way to insure the box trucks for a reasonable price and also uh the if you have any additional information about the payload it said four thousand uh pounds i don't know i thought they could uh carry more than that uh the water under storing the water and your waste under the bottom of it uh, I love the box truck idea because it doesn't have windows and you can add windows wherever you want to. I just love the idea of a box truck. I would want a box truck smaller than 16 feet. 10 to 12 feet is good enough for me. Uh, but I mean, if the only option is 16 feet, hey, mo the mo the better also i love the fact that the back tires have two tires on the back that way if you have a blowout you will still have another tire uh to where you can exit off the freeway or get to where you're going so that's always a good advantage when they have two tires so anyway you guys let me know what you think about today's video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe we're just thinking about alternative living uh inside of a vehicle i could do a lot with this vehicle i mean i could have a nice home in this vehicle and i could stand up my next vehicle i do want to be able to stand up and move around and i could just imagine the countless number of things that i could do with this vehicle so anyway let me know what you think about uh, a box truck as a home and uh Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and let me know if there's any other type of vehicles that you'd like for me to tour for you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell to be notified each and every time I upload a new video. And uh, if you want to support the channel, all the information is in the description box below. My cash app, my PayPal, my Amazon wish list, and my mailing address. You guys have a blessed and wonderful day. Thanks for watching. Bye now. could sit here all day you guys beautiful say hey say hey what you doing Vanessa watching God